Hello everyone. So in this video, we will try to solve another problem under Coulomb's law. So this is uh, our first practice problem for the Coulomb's law. So the electric force between two point charges with a magnitude of positive 150 nanocoulombs and 250 nanocoulombs is 20 newton. How far apart are the two charges from each other in centimeters? So the problem wants to find out the distance between the two charges. So the so yung formula na ginagamit natin ay F is equal to K Q1 Q2 over R squared. But in the problem, ang hinahanap lang ay ang distance between the two charges. So we'll derive uh, our formula here from this formula. So we can cross multiply. So we'll have K Q1 Q2 is equal to F R squared. Now let's divide, divide both sides by F. So we'll have cancel na to. So we have R squared is equal to KQ1 Q2 over F. Now, para matanggal itong squared dito, we can just extract the this, this square root of both sides. So we'll have so, wala na itong squared. So R is equal to the square root of KQ1 Q2 over F. Now, kung given natin sa problem, we have our Q1 is equal to positive 150 nanocoulombs. So that means nano, that means times 10 raised to negative 9 coulombs. And Q2 is equal to 250 nanocoulombs. So that means we have 250 times 10 raised to negative 9 columns. So they are both positive. So, hahanapin natin yung value ng R. So, let's solve for R using the formula that we have derived. So, R is equal to the square root of K is our constant. So, that's 9 times 10 raised to 9 newton meter squared per column squared times we have 150 or q1 times 10 is to negative 9 columns and third one uh, the second charge is 250 times 10 raised to negative 9 columns over we have our f is based on the given f is equal to 20 newton so over 20 newton so let's erase first from as maayos so we will extract the square root of this so r using the, the calc, r, uh, your calculator we can arrive with 4.11 times 10 raised to negative 3 meters. But the problem requires us that the distance should be in centimeters. So, this is equal to 0.41 centimeter. So, this is the final answer.